and before I'm yourself into. I spent the last decade dedicating myself to winning national championships and gold medals. I know how to put in work. Not like this. While you spent the last decade being catered to and taken care of, I trained in Calgary, the epicenter of wrestling, and then fought the best independent wrestlers in North America. And I've gotten the scars to prove it. We've all taken different roads to get here. Now, it's time to find out who deserves to stay. I've worked too hard for too long to get here, to let some walking shin guards fresh off the pitch steal my spot. I don't steal things. I earn them. Well, you've already earned a beatdown from me. So good luck. Hey, I'm Mei Lee, but everybody calls me Fanny. Nice to... because my last name is Fan and I'm a WWE super fan. And hopefully someday when I make it to WWE, there'll be Fandemonium. Get it? Sounds good, Fanny. Nice! I am so excited you're here. Oh yeah, are you a soccer fan too? Nope, I'm just tired of being the new girl. It's all WWE for me. I can't get enough. I even follow indies like PCW. You ever heard of Buzz? Yeah, I've even seen him wrestle once or twice. Once or twice? I've seen him wrestle 2,009 times. Most of them in person. Wow, that's... a lot. He actually put in a good word with management to get me in here. And this has been the best two weeks of my life. Well, maybe not quite as good as the two weeks I camped out for WrestleMania tickets in New Jersey. It was colder, but there were a lot fewer surprise super kicks. You know WrestleMania, right? Yeah, I don't live under a rock. It's only the biggest, greatest, grandest event in the entire universe. It's the crown jewel of sports entertainment. I've been six times, as a fan, obviously, but... Maybe. I mean, could you imagine? Fandemonium in the ring at WrestleMania? Anything can happen in WWE, right? So who knows? Maybe I'll be right there with you. Awesome! Sup, new girl? Welcome to the PC. Thanks. I'm happy to be here. Even though I'm mainly training the men right now, I'm always around if you need any advice. Good to know. One thing I can share with you right now is that in this business, you either have it or you don't. My daddy taught me something a long time ago. You could polish a dog turd all day, but at the end of the day, it's still doo-doo. I'm not sure I totally understand. Me neither. Why would anyone even want to polish dog poo? It's disgusting. Anyway, trust your gut, pick your spots, and make sure you don't end up in the D-O-double-G house. Good luck. First off, I'd like to officially welcome our newest recruit to the start of our WWE journey. If you hadn't noticed, there's a lot going on behind the scenes today, so fortunately, I don't have time to go through the big corporate speech that old Vinnie Mac and his pals in HR require me to give every single time a new trainee arrives. 
So we're going to cut to the chase. Have you met Chase? He used to dress like a giant rib. Huh? Fanny, zip it. Sorry, Mrs. Glamazon. Okay. As you may or may not know, the WWE superstars just finished up a huge European tour. Unfortunately, a big storm hit, and now their plane won't make it back in time for Raw in Miami tonight. There are a few superstars who weren't on the tour that are able to make the show, but now Sasha Banks doesn't have an opponent. OMG, the boss! Fanny! Anyway, we heard from Raw GM Mandy Rose that they're scrambling to find someone to take on Sasha. So, that's where one of you comes in. I'm already packed. Let's go. That's great. But we haven't made a decision on which one of you will face Sasha tonight. And in WWE, we like to solve our problems in the ring. There's no decision. It's me. She started hyperventilating the moment Beth walked in. You think she can wrestle on live television in front of the entire WWE universe? I can do it. I'll be fine. Whoa, whoa getting dizzy. I better sit down. Yeah, I'm out. And she hasn't been here long enough to know where the restrooms are. Third door on the right. <sighs> it's second door on the left, but close. Look, we're on a tight schedule. So we need to make a call, one way or another. Josie, you've been a bit banged up recently. Are you even up for this match? I can do it. Sasha Banks won't know what hit her. Okay, problem solved. Josie will go face Sasha. Not unless she gets through me first. The decision has already been made. I thought in WWE we solve our problems in the ring. Yeah, most of the time we do. But this is different. We're on a time crunch here. Sean, she's got a point. Okay, okay, fine. You two, get in the ring. When it goes to Raw to face Sasha Banks. And whatever you do, make it quick. Oh! <gasps> 
break. What do you want? I know I'm the one going to face Sasha Banks now, but just wanted to say, nice match. Thanks. I'll admit you're better than I thought. But you're lucky I'm not 100%. If I was, I'd be the one taking on Sasha Banks tonight. So next time we fight, I promise it won't be anything like our first encounter. I look forward to seeing you at your best. That was amazing! Are you so excited? I'm so excited and I'm not even going to Raw. How springy do you think the mat will be? Same as here or slightly different? Do you think Sasha Banks will smell good? Will you bring me back something from catering? Oh, and some hotel shampoo? Fanny, you're starting to hyperventilate again. I know, this is embarrassing. You're the one going and I'm hyperventilating. <gasps> I guess I'm just hyperventilating on the inside. Right, I'm gonna go try to calm down. Good luck, and don't forget the shampoo. Ugh, what are you doing here? What do you mean? I'm here to face Sasha Banks tonight. They sent you? You've been at the PC for what, 24 hours? I think it was just under three, actually. Great. I mean, first it was the travel issues and now this. Do you think the other GMs have to deal with this crap? No, they don't. They could have at least sent someone who spent some time inside a real ring. I thought it would be Josie Jane. So did she. But I'm here now, and I plan to make the most of my opportunity. Okay. I guess we'll have to make it work. Just try not to embarrass yourself or me or Raw, okay? You know what? That's too much to ask. Just don't get hurt. What's up? I'm R Truth. Welcome to Friday Night Raw. Isn't it Monday Night Raw? Man, I was one of the lucky ones who made it back from Europe. I'm so jet lagged, I don't know what day it is. But Raw is always on Mondays. 
only if you don't have a DVR. Anyway, someone told me you were a PC girl. That's right. Cool. I don't know nothing about computers, but I'm starting to think that fad is here to stay. It certainly looks that way. Listen, a little birdie told me you were here to face Sasha Banks. That's true. I'm hoping to give her everything I've got. Enough about that. The real question is, why are birdies telling me other people's secrets? I don't know. One of life's great mysteries, I guess. Anyway, good luck against Sasha. I got a feeling you're going to be fine. But keep an eye out for any gossiping birds. They're bad news. Thanks. Who are you? I'm actually your opponent tonight. No, you're not. I don't wrestle fans. I'm not a fan. Well, I am a fan, you know, of yours. And WWE, of course. But, I mean, I'm from the PC. I know who's at the PC. You? Ain't one of them. I just started today. And they sent you to face me? Are you kidding? I was supposed to have a Raw Women's Championship match against Naomi tonight. And now I'm facing off against this joke? <laughs> Wait, are you dying and this is your wish? Look, I get it. I'm brand new here and not what you expected. But what you can expect is for me to give you everything I've got. I can't imagine that's very much. I'm a boss. You're a nobody. After tonight, I might be a somebody. It's boss time. The standard, the blueprint, one of the most accomplished competitors in the ring. We have an unprecedented situation tonight where due to the fact almost the entire roster was stranded overseas, you're going to see some fresh faces on Raw. And one of those fresh faces is Sasha Banks' opponent who just started at the Performance Center earlier today. It's one thing to be a rookie and take on the boss, but this is insane. I have a feeling her face isn't gonna be so fresh after this is over. Hammerlock applied. Other arm trapped. Down on the arm. Beautiful. Planted with a neck breaker. Things are getting risky. This will not end well. On the apron. Banks being shown zero mercy, and Banks needs to go back to the drawing board. Whoa. On 
This is not good at all. The pendulum backbreaker stretch. Looking bad for her here. Oh, brutal for him. Places her right in the corner. Caught with a clothesline. A constant assault from her here. She's reading everything her opponent is trying to put. Taking flight. And oh, slips out of the way. Oh, man, what a kick from Sasha. That's got to knock the wind out of you. Launching. Oh, she lands hard. This could be big, going up high. Flying, diving shoulder tackle. And now she's climbing to the top turnbuckle. From the top, diving body splash. Consecutive high-risk maneuvers, and the pace of this match has certainly picked up. She has the boss's number and might just end this. It's over. And that may be all she wrote for Banks. Here's the cover for the win. One, two, three. Unbelievable. She did it. She beat Sasha Banks in her WWE debut. I never thought I'd see this happen here tonight. She just started the performance center this morning. This is unheard of. And the boss wants nothing to do with a handshake. She's livid. Sasha Banks is in shock right now. I would be too. Nonetheless, what a moment. You sure are luckier than a skinny caribou in September.
Lucky? I beat Sasha Banks fair and square. Don't ever forget, the only reason you were there was because I was hurt. That should have been me. I know you're angry at me. Maybe. You can try. Okay, tell me everything. How did it feel? Winning? I mean, it felt great. Obviously. No, not that. I want to know about the ring, the ropes. How was the catering? Do they use real silverware or plastic? Oh, do they have extra underwear in case you get so excited that you pee a little? Um, I didn't ask. Did you shower after? Sorry, stupid question. I don't think I would, though. Talk about a sweat souvenir. I can't believe you beat Sasha Banks. Do you want to watch the match? I've recorded the whole thing on my phone. I've seen it about 30 times already. No thanks. I was there. I know how it turned out. Totally. I'm gonna watch it again, though, either way. Still can't believe it! See you out there, champ!
Like everyone else, I was glued to my TV last night. Congratulations. A really impressive win, especially right out of the gate. Thanks. I'm glad I was able to prove myself. Let's not spend too much time in the afterglow. You still have a long road ahead of you. Time to get back to the grind. I know. I still can't believe I beat Sasha Banks on Raw. But I'm not gonna let one match, even a win that big, define my career. I'm here to be the best I can be. Good. Because after what I saw, I'm getting in the ring with you myself. And uh, now? My neck's still a little stiff from last night. <laughs> Nothing a few glam slams can't fix. Come on. Let's find out if you got lucky last night, or if you really are that good.
Come <laughs> on. 